I normally come to the milk pail for the fruits and vegetables. And they do a lot of good for the community. You know? Because so many people come and the turnover is fast, so they stay fresh. The, the supply is always fresh, and always the diversity is there. I'm from Russia. Everything from Russia, I see here. A lot of products from Russia. I like to shop at an independent place. And I like to support the independent people that are doing something, rather than big chains. because I meet a lot of people I know here all the time and that's my connection I you know know everybody who works here now I've been coming for a long time I'm from Kentucky, so I'm from a smaller community, and there we really try to support local businesses and you know other local affiliates. And usually, the people who own those businesses are your friends and family. So coming out here, you know, you like to support that network, knowing that it's other people's friends and families that are running the business and that that's helping sustain their living. And also, it helps sustain the local economy. Not letting you know corporate interests come and infringe upon that sense of community is really important to me. Uh, because there's a lot of Hispanics that work here, so I feel really comfortable going up to them and asking them. Hey, where's the the beans or where's the you know the local fruit? So I'm I feel very comfortable here. Yes. So and I really enjoy the help they have here. They seem to know a lot about the fruit and, and they help me pick out everything. And it's usually very good. Cheese. Produce and cheese. I love the tomatoes. A lot of Chinese vegetables. We eat lots of Mexican food, so they have good chilies and things to make yummy salads, tomatoes and fruits, all kinds of stuff. Well, um, I prefer locally grown because then I know that it's fresh. When it's overseas, most of the time the vegetables and fruit are not fresh. They're frozen or they're picked green and then they ripen uh, during traveling time. Oh, we should definitely buy locally grown product whenever we can. And the energy footprint of bringing things from Mexico and from Peru all the way here is huge. So if we can, we should. We want to help the local farmers also, instead of um, buying produce out of the area. Locally grown produce is of course better for you because there are guidelines to check for the safety and it's regulated by FDA to make sure that uh, they use safe uh, pesticides and fertilizer to grow it. Uh, but uh, imported uh, produce uh, is kind of hard to make sure those guidelines are uh, um, in place and uh, there is checks and balances for that. I don't know, it just seems like it's good healthy food and I think it, I don't know, I think it can't be anything but good for the community to have places like this. So, When you can come in and see the owner checking out how things are set up and guiding things. Um, you know, go to a large chain store and you're not going to see the owner, you're not going to see the manager, you're going to see people who don't really care about, you know, just uh, more bottom line, um, financially responsible decisions instead of people that they get to look at every day and go, what's best for that person? Why is that? I want to see that person again, you know. Um,
the day, we are going to be 